We just passed the halfway point of the year 2024 and tech companies had a strong start to the new quarter. We'll reveal the winners and losers that drove 68% of the index performance and which companies will announce earnings next week. As usual, don't forget to subscribe to understand how individual stocks impact the S&P 500. Let's jump right into, it into today's S&P saga. The S&P 500 closed the week at 5,567.19, up 2% from last week adding over a trillion dollars in market cap. The P ratio, based on current price and the latest earnings, stands at 28.93, up 0.55 points since last week. Here are your gainers. Apple is up 241.1 billion or 7.5% on reports that the company may require a subscription for its new Apple intelligence service. Tesla is up 171.1 billion or 27.1%, an outstanding return after the company reported better than expected vehicle deliveries for the quarter. This is a spectacular performance for a company of this size. Microsoft is up 153.2 billion or 4.7%. 6% as the company announced additional layoffs this year. Alphabet is up 105.5 billion or 4.7% following the company's announcement that it's shutting down Mineral, one of its moonshot projects. Meta is up 90.5 billion or 7.1% on reported plans to add AI features to its metaverse games. Moving to your losers, United Health is down 19.9 billion or 4.2% after conceding some benefits related to its merger with Amedesis. Home Depot is down 9.7 billion or 2.8% on no specific news. Exxon down 8 billion or 1.5% on no specific news as well. Danair down 7.9 billion or 4.2% on no specific news. Finally, AbV is down 7.6 billion or 2.5% after the company cut its 2024 profit forecast on increased R&D expenses. This week, there were no changes announced to the S&P 500. So what should you look out for next week? We're headed into earnings season again and financial institutions will kick off the announcements. Nine companies will release earnings during the week ending July 12th, 2024. And the most interesting will be Pepsi on July 11th at 6 a.m. Eastern Time expected to report $2.16 EPS on $22.65 billion of revenue for the Q2 2024 results. JP Morgan on July 12th at 8.30 a.m. Eastern Time expected to report $4.33 EPS on $44.35 billion of revenue for their Q2 2024 results. Wells Fargo, on July 12th, at a time to be confirmed, expected to report $1.18 EPS on $19.9 billion of revenue for their Q2 2024 results. Citigroup, on July 12th at 8 a.m. Eastern Time, expected to report $1.40 EPS on $20.1 billion of revenue for their Q2 2024 results. Which company do you think will top the list next week and why? Let us know in the comments below and subscribe for our weekly updates. To find out why Apple and Tesla were up last week, you should watch this video next.